Welcome to the channel. Today we're diving into a major development in the global defense and aviation industry. Spain is considering purchasing Turkey's next generation Hürjet fighter jet. This move is set to be a game changer for both nations, enhancing Spain's air force capabilities while strengthening Turkey's growing presence in the global defense market. In this video, we'll explore what makes Hürjet an attractive choice for Spain, its key technical specifications, the military and strategic significance of this potential deal, and the recent joint flight between the Spanish and Turkish Air Force commanders. But before we get into those details, let's first take a look at how Spain's interest in Herjet developed and the agreements that have already been signed between the two nations. Spain has been on the lookout for a next-generation trainer aircraft to replace its aging F-5 fighter jets, which have served for decades but are now nearing retirement. Several options have been considered, including the Boeing Saab T-7, KAI T-50, and the Alenia Ermaci M346. However, Herjet has emerged as a strong contender due to its cutting-edge avionics, advanced maneuverability, and cost-effectiveness. Recognizing the potential for collaboration, Turkey and Spain formalized their cooperation by signing a Memorandum of Understanding, MOU, on December 20, 2024. This agreement was seen as a major step forward in strengthening bilateral defense ties and laid the groundwork for potential Herjet exports to Spain. To further assess the aircraft's performance, Hurriet conducted a demonstration tour in Spain in mid-2024, showcasing its superior capabilities to Spanish officials and military experts. This tour played a crucial role in solidifying Spain's interest in the aircraft. In this video, we'll explore the background and technical prowess of the Herjet, discuss Spain's strategic interest, and review a high-profile formation flight performed by the Turkish and Spanish Air Force commanders. Let's get started. Background of the Herjet project. First, let's take a closer look at the Herjet. Developed by Turkish Aerospace Industries, the Herjet is an indigenous light combat and advanced trainer jet that symbolizes Turkey's growing ambition in the global defense market. The Herjet project represents Turkey's ambitious leap into the world of advanced jet training and light combat aircraft. But how did this innovative aircraft come to life? To understand its significance today, we need to take a look at its development journey, one that spans nearly a decade. In 2017, the Turkish defense industry made a strategic decision to develop a domestically produced next-generation jet trainer to replace the aging Northrop T-38 Talon fleet of the Turkish Air Force. These aircraft had been in service for decades, but with Turkey's increasing need for indigenous military technology, the search for a locally developed solution began. It was during this period that Turkish Aerospace Industries TUSASH officially launched the Herjet project with the goal of creating a high-performance, supersonic-capable training and light combat jet. By 2018, TAI had completed the preliminary studies for the aircraft's aerodynamic design and overall specifications. Throughout 2019, intensive wind tunnel tests were conducted to refine the aircraft's structure, ensuring optimal maneuverability and stability. TAI worked closely with the Turkish Air Force and key defense industry partners to finalize the aircraft's cockpit design, avionics, and mission systems. The aim was to create a cutting-edge platform that would not only serve as a jet trainer, but could also be adapted for combat missions. After years of research and testing, TAI unveiled the first full-scale Herjet prototype in 2022. This was a significant moment for Turkey's aerospace industry as it marked the transition from concept to reality. The aircraft's first ground tests, including engine runs and taxi tests, were successfully completed at Mertid Airfield Command in Ankara by late 2022. Then came a historic day for Turkish aviation. On April 25, 2023, Herjet took to the skies for the very first time. The aircraft completed a 26-minute maiden flight, demonstrating smooth handling, stable aerodynamics, and advanced flight control capabilities. This successful flight proved that Herjet was not just a paper project, but a fully functional, high-performance aircraft ready to serve in both training and light attack roles. Following its maiden flight, Herjet quickly gained international attention. 
Throughout 2023 and 2024, the aircraft was showcased at major aerospace and defense expos worldwide, including Paris Air Show, June 2023, Dubai Air Show, November 2023, Farnborough Air Show, July 2024. These events provided an opportunity for potential buyers, including Spain, to evaluate the aircraft's capabilities and export potential. Recognizing its potential, Spain formally expressed interest in Herjet in mid-2024 as part of its plan to replace the aging F-5s in its Air Force training fleet. This led to a series of bilateral discussions between Turkey and Spain, culminating in a Memorandum of Understanding, MOU, signed in December 2024. This agreement set the stage for further technical evaluations, joint test flights, and a possible procurement deal. Now, as we enter 2025, Herjet continues to evolve. With advanced avionics, supersonic capability, and a modular combat system, it is poised to become one of the most versatile jet trainers and light combat aircraft in the world. With Spain moving closer to a potential acquisition, Herjet's future on the global stage looks more promising than ever. Technical and performance highlights. Herjet is not just another jet trainer. It is a high-tech, multi-role aircraft built with next-generation avionics, superior maneuverability, and combat-ready features. Designed and developed by Turkish Aerospace Industries Tusash, this aircraft brings together speed, agility, and advanced systems to meet the evolving demands of modern air forces. But what exactly makes Herjet a game-changer? Let's break down its technical specifications and performance capabilities. Power and propulsion. Speed meets efficiency. Engine. General Electric F404-GE-102 turbofan. Thrust output. 17,000 pounds force, 76 kilonewtons. Maximum speed. Mach 1.4, approximately 1,750 kilometers per hour, or 1,087 miles per hour. Operational ceiling, 45,000 feet, 13,716 meters. Range, 2,592 kilometers, 1,610 miles, with external fuel tanks. The heart of Herjet is its F404-GE-102 turbofan engine, one of the most reliable and widely used jet engines in the world, also found in aircraft like the FA-18 Hornet and Saab Gripen. With a maximum speed of Mach 1.4, Herjet can easily outpace many legacy jet trainers and even operate in light combat scenarios. Its operational ceiling of 45,000 feet allows it to function at high altitudes, ensuring optimal training for pilots transitioning to supersonic fighter jets like the F-16 and F-35, advanced avionics, a smart cockpit for future pilots, cockpit display, full glass cockpit with wide-angle head-up display HUD, flight control system, digital fly-by-wire FBW, helmet-mounted display, HMD, compatible for augmented reality training, mission computer, integrated with artificial intelligence, AI, for advanced analytics. Herjet's cockpit is designed to replicate the interface of modern fighter jets, making the transition from trainer to combat aircraft as seamless as possible. The aircraft features a full glass cockpit, a wide angle HUD, and an AI-assisted mission computer that enhances situational awareness. Additionally, its digital fly-by-wire system provides superior handling and responsiveness, even under extreme maneuvers. One of Herjet's most futuristic features is its helmet-mounted display, HMD, which allows pilots to train using augmented reality simulations. This means pilots can engage in mock dogfights, target tracking, and missile lock-ons using virtual threats projected into their field of view. Combat capabilities, more than just a trainer. Hardpoints, seven external hardpoints, three under each wing, one centerline. Weapons compatibility, air-to-air -air missiles, AIM-9X, Sidewinder, Gyakdoan, Turkey's indigenous AIM, air-to-ground weapons, laser-guided bombs, SOMJ cruise missile, machine guns and cannons, optional 20mm internal cannon, electronic warfare, EW, ECM pods for self-defense. 
Unlike conventional trainers, her jet is designed with multi-role combat capability. With seven external hardpoints, it can be equipped with a variety of air-to-air -air and air-to-ground weapons, including Turkey's indigenous Gukdoan missile, AIM-9X Sidewinder, and even the SOM-J cruise missile. This means her jet can function as a light attack jet, making it an affordable and effective solution for countries looking to bolster their defense without investing in expensive fourth or fifth generation fighters. Versatility and modular design, adaptable for different missions. Trainer role, primary function as an advanced jet trainer. Light combat role, equipped for close air support and strike missions. Aerobatic jet, engineered for high G maneuvers and display teams, e.g. Turkish stars. Naval variant, future plan, feasibility studies for a carrier-capable version. Herjet's design is not limited to training missions. Its modular structure allows it to be easily configured for combat, aerobatics, or even naval operations. Currently, feasibility studies are being conducted for a carrier-capable variant, which could eventually see Herjet operating from Turkish Navy's TCG Anadolu or future aircraft carriers. Maintenance and cost efficiency, a smart investment for air forces. Maintenance interval, lower than conventional jet trainers. Life cycle cost, 30 to 40% lower than advanced fighter jets. Operational readiness, high availability for training missions. Compared to older jet trainers and even some modern equivalents, Herjet offers lower maintenance costs and higher reliability. With a 30 to 40% lower life cycle cost than frontline fighters, it provides air forces with a cost-effective solution for pilot training and combat support operations. With its state-of-the-art avionics, multi-role combat capabilities, and cost-efficient operations, Herjet is more than just a trainer. It's a force multiplier. For Spain, this aircraft represents a next-generation solution that aligns with its strategic needs. And with Turkey's commitment to innovation, Herjet is set to shape the future of military aviation worldwide. In the next section, we'll explore Spain's interest in Herjet and what this potential deal means for both nations. Spain's interest and strategic context. In recent developments, Spain has shown serious interest in acquiring the Herjet. This initiative comes as part of a broader trend among European nations to seek out innovative and cost-effective solutions for modernizing their air forces. Spain is aiming to diversify its fighter fleet with platforms that combine advanced capabilities with budget-friendly options. The Herjet fits this vision perfectly. Beyond enhancing operational readiness, this move also reinforces bilateral ties with Turkey, an important partner in regional and NATO defense frameworks. The potential acquisition promises to influence not just Spain's defense strategies, but also the dynamics of European defense cooperation. High-profile visit and flight. An event that has caught the attention of military analysts is the recent joint formation flight conducted by the Turkish Air Force Commander, General Zia Cemal Kadiolu, and the Spanish Air Force Commander, General Francisco Braxo Carbo. Invited by General Kadiolu, General Carbo traveled to Ankara and began his visit at the Air Force headquarters, where both commanders attended a meeting. They then visited the Turkish Aerospace Industries, TUSAS, facilities in Karamankazan. During the visit, the two commanders climbed into a Herjet prototype and executed a test flight together in a precise formation, often referred to as a Kol Uchushu in Turkish. The formation flight, conducted in mid-air, was not only a demonstration of the aircraft's agile performance, but also a powerful symbol of the deepening defense collaboration between Turkey and Spain. Following the test, the aircraft landed at the Murtid Maiden Command headquarters, marking the flight as a significant milestone in bilateral military cooperation. Tusash celebrated this achievement on its official social media by stating, With every new flight, we not only raise our targets but also make history with our star-adorned wings in the blue of Gokvatan. This statement underlines the pride and significance of the joint exercise, emphasizing the growing partnership between the Turkish and Spanish air forces. Diplomatic and economic implications. Beyond the immediate technical and operational advantages, the potential sale of the Hürjet carries significant diplomatic and economic implications. 
In December 2024, Turkey and Spain signed a Memorandum of Understanding for the Hürjet Training Aircraft Project. According to Defense Industry President Prof. Dr. Haluk Gergen, this agreement is set to form the foundation for deeper collaboration between the Turkish Ministry of National Defense and the Spanish Ministry of Defense. Such an agreement not only strengthens bilateral ties, but also reinforces the broader framework of NATO alliances. Economically, this deal could boost Turkey's defense industry by creating jobs and expanding its global market reach, while providing Spain with a cost-effective upgrade for its air force. Ultimately, this partnership is a forward-thinking move aimed at rebalancing defense priorities in a rapidly changing global landscape. Conclusion In summary, Spain's potential acquisition of the Herjet is a multifaceted story of technological innovation, strategic realignment, and international collaboration. The Herjet stands as a testament to Turkey's commitment to developing cutting-edge aerospace technology, while the joint formation flight between the Turkish and Spanish Air Force commanders highlights the tangible steps being taken toward closer defense ties. With the recent signing of the MOU for the Herjet Training Aircraft Project, this collaboration is set to pave the way for even more significant partnerships in the future. What are your thoughts on this emerging trend in international defense? Let us know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this analysis, please like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more updates on global defense developments. Until next time, stay informed and stay safe. Thanks for watching. Subscribe Defense Lab's YouTube channel for aviation and defense industry news and updates.